Good morning, good afternoon. This is Deborah Cargo coming to you live from Valdosta, Georgia on May 14, 2019 for our daily devotion. Our assignment should concern us more than our destination. Heaven is your destination. Now is your assignment. We must recognize the significance of the moment we have been placed in if we are going to be effective agents of kingdom trans transformation. When we see the promises of God and the supernatural demonstrations of his power as exclusively reserved for the millennium, we will not place any demand upon our faith in this present hour. This keeps us looking forward to our day of destination rather than being effective stewards of our present assignment. We must be known for hope for the day we live in as the purposes of God are always great. He will do everything needed according to his promises for his victorious bride. When Jesus said there would be wars and rumors of war, Matthew 24, 6, he wasn't giving us a promise. He was describing the conditions into which he was releasing his last day's army of transformational people. Daily scripture reading for today is Acts 1, verse 9 through 11. So let's go there. And when he had said this, even as they were looking at him, he was caught up in a cloud received and carried him away out of their sight. And while they were gazing intently into heaven as he went, behold, two men dressed in white robes suddenly stood beside them. Who said, man of Galilee, why do you stand gazing into heaven? This same Jesus who was caught away and lifted up from among you into heaven will return in just the same way in which you saw him go into heaven. Amen. Today's prayer. Heaven fills my heart with delight and excitement. But Lord, that is my destination. Help me to not focus on my destination in heaven to the point where I start neglecting my assignment on earth. In fact, show me how I get to experience some of my destination now by releasing your kingdom on earth. Holy Spirit, you are the down payment of eternity. You have come from the age to come. I can experience some of the glory and joy of eternity right now because of your presence in my life. Thank you, and God bless you all.